The memorial at the corner of Duncanville Road and Ranchero Lane is for Danny Ortiz, a motorcyclist killed three years ago when a drunk driver pulled in front of him. 60-year-old Brian Lee Howard was that other driver. It would be his third DWI. I don't think it's fair. I do not think that my brother got the justice that he deserved. Because last month after COVID shutdowns and other delays, a Dallas County judge finally delivered the sentence. Although intoxication manslaughter ranges from two to 20 years in prison, Brian Lee Howard received six months in a prison alcohol treatment program, which he began serving earlier this month in a TDCJ prison in Winsboro, Texas. I told him um, that I thought the sentence was a joke, that he, I felt that the judge gave him a slap on the wrist for killing my brother. Brian and I are painfully aware of their pain and what they've been through. Howard's defense attorney believes the sentence was appropriate, that Howard has changed his life and will spend six months to a year in a sober living halfway house when he is released. With tragedies uh, and with mistakes comes the possibility of redemption and forgiveness. Forgiveness difficult for a sister now helping raise her brother's three children and wears an angel wing necklace made with some of her brother's ashes. I hope this sheds light um, to the prosecutors, to the court, to the judge to realize, hey, your sentence really wasn't fair. Fairness she hoped would come with a sentence of at least 10 years. In Dallas, I'm Kevin Reese.